Well guys, it's official, Rockstar Games has just announced the Criminal Enterprises DLC update for GTA Online. I already watched the trailer, but the clip just recorded my Discord for some reason. So we're watching it again, and I'm going to say there's only two things I am truly happy about about this update so far. So let's start it from the beginning here and see what's up. The very first thing we see is the city, and I believe that is a new helicopter. It looks okay, but it looks really cheap. I'm not sure what helicopter that is, but we got a new one. You can see a sun in the background, looking pretty nice. You can see we got some cars here. Now, I'm not 100% sure if the one on the right is a new car, but I'm pretty sure the one on the left right there is a new vehicle. No idea what they're called, but it's looking like Benny's vehicles. So, you know what? We can get excited for that. Back at the nightclub, they're talking about the 1980s. This is some sick shit, guys. There is now a luxury auto shop. Yes. So, will we be able to buy cars from this? I don't know. But it is going to be here, which is sick. And you can see right here, this is clearly the e-tron yes that's right i believe we're getting an e-tron in gta online if this is not an e-tron then i don't know which audi this is but it looks like an e-tron to me we are also getting this thing no idea what the hell it is but it looks pretty sick and then behind it what was that what was that let's let's take a trip back there for a second somebody needs to tell me if that is a new car well, let's try to get a good look at it right here i don't know if that is a new car or not i honestly cannot tell okay we're back in our ceo office talking about some stuff on the docks this is pretty cool scuba diving placing bombs on containers kind of cool i guess apparently there was talk about pirates but who cares about that because look at the freaking screen that is a new r8 baby we've been waiting years years on end for this shit and it's finally there in front of that we have the brand new 2022 lamborghini Countach, and in front of that i don't know what car that is what car is that? That is also a new car. No idea what it is, though. See, oh, of course, they don't show it. They show a little sneak peek of it. But guys, look how freaking beautiful this R8 looks. Oh, my goodness. I'm in love. I'm in love. You should have heard me scream when I found out they added a new one. <gasps> yes! Finally! And then it gets better, guys, because for all of the car lovers out there who love muscle cars... Something here is special for you. Can we got something sick. And it looks like we're going to be able to carry crates with a cargo bob. That would be awesome. I'm pretty sure this is a brand new gun. Vom Foyer Gun Manufacturers Suite. So we're going to be able to manufacture some new guns, hopefully. We also got that thing. Not going to lie, that looks pretty sick. That looks like a dragster type of car. Honestly, that's pretty damn cool. We got something here. Yes, let's take a look at this. So it's looking like we're going to have some new off-roading trucks. I believe this is the one that they showcased earlier, but without as many mods. Kind of resembles a modified Ford Bronco, maybe. Not 100% sure, but that's not the important part. Look at that sexy thing, baby. We have a freaking Camaro, guys. We have finally gotten a Camaro in GTA Online. It's about freaking time. Like I said, when there's two things I'm excited about, the R8 and the Camaro, that is it. I really don't care about anything else so far. It's just those two cars. There is a guy. That, I'm pretty sure we already have that stuff. And yeah, that's pretty much the entire trailer. So... Let me know what you guys think of it down below. What are you most hyped about from watching this trailer? For me, it's just the R8 and the Camaro and pretty much all of the new vehicles in general. Anyways, this is going to be a pretty awesome update just for vehicles and probably the storyline is going to be cool as well. Anyways, let me know what you guys think of this update down below in the comments section. And with that said, I will catch you guys in the next video.